Welcome to the class of Racing Academy. In this stage, you'll drive the Ford GT on the reverse Bayoun Mountain track. The difficulty of this stage lies in memorizing the track carefully and adeptly executing the out and out lane. As in most cases, looking at the minimap in the top left corner can help you find the best route. After the start, your vehicle will come to a relatively gentle U-shaped corner. You need to keep your vehicle as close to the left as possible and start drifting earlier. Your drift angle shouldn't be too wide. Otherwise, any subsequent adjustments will slow you down. When drifting to this position in front of the apex, increase your throttle in time so that your vehicle hits the sidewalk on the inner corner. Try to use up the width of the track as much as possible so that your vehicle can turn at a higher speed. When your vehicle's sliding direction points forward, following the track, you need to turn left in time to exit the drift and move to the left side of the track. If you manage to pull it off, congratulations! You've just completed your first out and out turn. Next, we have the second corner. Let your vehicle move to the sidewalk on the left side. This allows your vehicle to stay as close to the left as possible when passing the corner. Now comes the third corner. It looks like a sharp right turn, but in fact, as long as you use the width of the track to let your vehicle pass the corner, you can quickly cross it while maintaining speed. After the third corner, your vehicle will move to the outer track. Here, you need to be careful to keep turning right and let your vehicle follow the outside of the track to the next corner. Next, we continue with the out and out lane, starting by drifting from the outside. Remember what we said at the beginning, keep an eye on the mini map. By looking at the mini map, you can see that this corner is composed of two corners. Don't rush through the first corner but center on the apex of the second corner to smoothly use the out and out lane to pass the two combined corners. Finally, move your vehicle to the sidewalk on the right and pass through the apex of the corner. The mini map will indicate that the next corner is a left high speed U-turn. Counter steer immediately and let your vehicle start side changing drift early. Enter the next corner and then you'll pass the stage with ease. Does clearing the stage means the end? Of course not. The techniques you practice here in the Racing Academy will determine your success on the tracks of Racing Master. Want to know more about Racing Master? Follow Racing Master's official Facebook page for first-hand news.